Hello everybody. Hello. 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 Another ukulele lesson. So today we were speaking about uh, uh, writing the songs, your own songs. It's not necessary to use uh, uh, complicated chords. It's just uh, uh, a matter of inspiration, of course, as you said. If you if you see a bird in the sky, you can uh, write uh, lyrics a bird in the sky or. Um, really easy also to um, in the beginning find the chords that you like maybe the easiest one or uh, the hardest one is a choice in uh, uh, Serena she writes a song and uh, we can start from your song but it, because I want to show you the way how you can write a song and also the um, ecco amore yes no, the, because uh, she she's uh, she's writing a song, easy, C, G, A minor, F, no, yes. or something. This is the normal progression. No, 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 Ellie, no. Ellie. I did in I did in this way. A C, G, A minor, F. So the standard one. I was studying the yes. progression of chords. Can you it? I was studying the progression of chords. Then. I decide I want to learn this progression, but I don't know how to write a song, so I choose another song and then I change some words and then I change some other words and at the end I thought about I want to speak about my life in Poland, okay? And then changing and changing the song is coming, but just with the model. Exactly. But the, the, uh, you, you can play the song one time, just a few lines, if I am able because to. I, want, uh, I want to show you, you. the differences you. between uh, playing the same song in different way. And uh, there are also all techniques that we already know. Okay? Please. Mm, I don't know if I'm able to. This is the tension also of uh, writing your own no, song because I, maybe this sometimes. This is my ignorance. No, no, come on, words. come on. So the, this song uh, is uh, written by Serena and is C, G, A minor, F. So the basic one, really. Easy. After that, you are ready for the church. So you can so you can sing into the church. <laughs> so. It's also the first time that you're playing your own song in front of somebody else that is not me. <laughs> it's also this that is important. So, what song did you use as your base? No, no, I find that I, before I choose the progression of chords. Then, C, G, A minor, right? Yes, then I, t I took a look at some, some minor, other songs song. just to divide and then I changed some words. And then I change some other, and then it comes. But because if we, if we if we listen to the pattern, the sounds of these songs, it, it seems like somewhere over the rainbow in some yeah. in some play, in some yeah. yeah, some melodies and something. So it's okay, because all the the most famous songs that we know mostly are already they they are always taking something from the background, which kind of music they are listening. There is always a, a sort of not stealing, 
but it's an inspiration always. They call it inspiration. It's not stealing. But also, a lot of songs are completely the same, but at the end they are not the same because you change the melody, you change the harmony, they, maybe the chords are the same, but that's okay. So she was doing down, down, up, and down. More or less. the yes. same, no? So yeah. if we listen to the to the song, it seems uh, uh, like uh, flat because the the ukulele is always the plane's the same. So I said to her, why don't you do like uh, uh, dividing the verse uh, with the chorus? In the verse also the voice is low, so she can, she can do one technique. Same song, eh? same. Palmuti, then when the chorus starts. Also, you don't have to change the pattern of the right hand, just here. This is the dynamics. Yes, I, I, I like the last time we, we were doing the, we tried the palm motif. You have to put the palm on the, on the strings. And then, and then, hey! And then. Like I put my palm here, at the end of the ukulele, at the end. So, usually we are playing here, no? But when you want to do the palm muting, you put the palm on the, on the uh, ear and then... Oh, behind the, behind the bridge. Yes, on here. The bridge. A little bit behind. And try, try to do the C chord in this technique. Yes. Try, try. This is only trying. Yes. Yes, it's okay like that. You, you feel now when you, then when you, when you then you leave the, the hands and this is one technique. Try. This is the palm moting. So it, uh, if you have a song that is uh, almost uh, the same from the beginning till the end, because we don't we don't change the chords between the verse, the chorus, the bridge. So we can use different techniques for uh, uh, um, yes, mixed. Uh, the, yes, try, try. Yes, uh, you have, these are uh, uh, the the the, the um, core or everything is always the same. Practicing and find your own way to make the sounds out of the ukulele. Another another thing. I'm just showing some example, then you, you can also go deeper in your song, because you already have a song. Yeah. But you, that's what I, was, I want to say to you, because you have already a song. You have the chords and you have the lyrics, no? So you can go deeper in this way, like... I remember it was... of the volume of the ukulele. This is a, a, a good starting also for understanding the, how you can push on the ukulele and how you can uh, divide the song in the different moments. Because it is a, it's like a sort of emotion. You play, uh, you sing uh, like, um, like a whisper. You cannot play the ukulele. Nobody is listening. So you Try to also connect your voice on your uh, harmonies or your melodies between also the power that you put on the strings. Okay? Another option, like we were thinking.
best can be like that. But it's important also to uh, make some uh, stop between when we are playing because here we are, I'm just doing the right uh, pattern of my right hand is down, down, down. But if you listen, I'm doing down, down. So the accent is is in the last down. This is important too. The accent putting putting the accent in the the way that we prefer because we can also do I'm doing just three times down 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 but before was and this is you can choose the one that you prefer so these are two techniques for the for uh, making a difference between the chorus and the verse okay these are just to the, you that you have read the song. You can try to uh, find the difference between the verse and the chorus. Okay, that's it. If we, I, I don't know. We can do something. I want to show you some other uh, exercises now today for uh, uh, connecting better the left hand with the right hand. Can I show the exercise? So. This is an exercise that you can do every time every, that you prefer. You have to put your hands like this. One, in order to put the first finger on the first fret, second finger on the third fret, third finger on the third fret, and fourth finger on the first fret. Because we have to do that, yes. That's not, that's not easy because you see we are opening the end. Okay, we are opening the fingers. The pinky is very weak. Yeah, I know. The pinky is very weak. That's normal. <laughs> and we have to do that. So. So, one, two, three, four, three, two. One. Okay? This is the first. Every time that you want to practice, because it is a good way also for uh, warming up our fingers and our connection between the hands and the mind. And try to, yes, try also to connect. Like the sound, because we can do. But you can connect. Si, si. It's not easy because the ukulele is also small. But because the, this is the first, the first exercise, but the complete one is this. One, two, three, four. Then we go down on the other string. One, two, three. Four. Then the third one, two, three, four. Wow. <laughs> Very nice. So this is an exercise really, really important if you want to connect your mind, your um, fingers. Which way are you going down? After you do. See? Yes. Then you go down. So is a. Fourth string, first fret, second second fret, third fret, fourth fret. Then third string, exactly, exactly, like this. Oh, that's a good one. Yes, that's a good one. And that's from here. When we arrive here, at the end of the, uh, on in the first string, we go up. 
So, four, three, two, one, four, three. It's tricky, eh? <laughs> Yes, it's perfect, it's perfect. In the, end, in the beginning also, uh, your hands can uh, um, have a little bit of, can hurt you. You, have, you can feel pain, but it's a good sign, like when you're doing yoga that you're shaking. Having pain is a good sign, because we are, we are, building, uh, we are building strength in our left hand. What about the burning faces? Yes. Yeah, yeah, of course. <laughs> Because if I look in your face, it... <laughs> yes, that's a good exercise. And you see, Serena, she's doing it in this way because she always lifts up. Uh, but try, yes, try to leave the fingers on the strings. So I'm playing the the one, and this this finger stay in the first uh, um, fret. So the second I put and but but I leave you see so because there is two ways of doing this this and then you can lift up but the best way is to uh, continue to push on the on the neck because then you will you build the strength in your in your hands you see so you push on two parts all one and then this is down and i leave it down the second down and i leave it down the third down and i leave it down the fourth down and i leave it down okay, okay. this is the first exercise that you can practice any time and in any bravo bravo team. perfect it's not in tune i think yes let's look it can be yeah Remember all eh? It's just not a good sounding exercise. Yes. It sounds like something is being painfully killed. Oh. More or less, yes. Remember always to, to, to check the, the tuning of ukulele sometimes when you're playing. Bravo, perfect. And try to go down and up. Down and up. Yes, also on the other strings. Yes, perfect. <laughs> Sometimes the strings are not playing good, so it means that you have to push more, of course. And also, this is a good exercise also to uh, understanding better the distance of, uh, between the, the fret, the strings, because if you don't push, if you don't push in the, in the center, of the fret. It's not, it's not something good. Yeah. <laughs> this is one and I will send you also the video so we can uh, we can uh, do it together. Another one. Bravo Serena. No, uh, fingers is hurting, eh? yes. Because now we are we have to try it, we have to find a way because I was thinking if you want to play for one hour, half an hour, with friends. When, you're, when we are looking at the sunset, we want to play. We want to play long, no? So we need a, a, need a little bit more of strength in our left hand. Another exercise is this. So you put your first finger on the... First string. No? String. Yes, on the... First string. Yes, exactly. So, first finger. Fourth string, first fret, and then we do down, and then we go down on the third string, then the second string, and then the first string, and then up, second, one, two. This is the other one, this is another one. <laughs> you see, it's like a first finger, first fret. But it's really good for yeah, yeah. It's really good for your fingers because uh, you know you will uh, use all your hands and you have also always to try to put uh, 
the fingers like in a hammer style, no, like a hammer. Down. If you don't push, you don't push good. Listen, the sound is not good. And same exercise, second fret, second finger. Same also the third one. Da, da, da. This is the difficult. And then. <laughs> and smile. <laughs> that is enough. It's really important. It's okay. Not easy, eh? Show, show, fine with it. Because if you're not uh, pushing good or you're not in the center of the fret, it's not playing, okay? So this is the second one. So we have already a lot of uh, work to do at home. But I want to show you the third one. So you do like this, uh, the same as before. So we were using all the fingers, but this is, is one and nothing two and nothing three and nothing four and strings so we push on the first uh, first fret four string first finger and then we play the open string so ding okay clear and then the, uh, the opposite open Four, open, third, open, second, open, first. Eh? With all the with all the strings we can do. <laughs> you see? Because now we are we are Think about why I'm doing this uh, exercise for you. What, what are we using now? The thumb, okay? We are using the thumb. Because one day, maybe the next lesson, when you will be a, more, a little bit more uh, um, strong, strong and fast in this, we can do that. Because you see, the thumb is always do the same. Down. I'm just doing the C chord. Eh? C chord and thumb on the first string. Then middle finger on the last. So is thumb. When you're plucking, should you pluck by the... Sorry? When you pluck in strings, should you pluck by the whole right? Yes, exactly. You know, you know why I'm not playing here. Good, good uh, question. I'm not playing here. Because if you want to do the fingers, this is called finger picking. Because we are picking strings with our fingers, no? So, you see, my hands is going back. And I can, I use this, you can use this. Or I use uh, the end of the ukulele like a support. Because then my, my finger, because if I'm using the ends like this, that is far from the ukulele, I have no, it's not so easy to, because everything is moving and I have no uh, part where I have, I'm, I'm stability is called, no? So if we do that, so thumb on the first string, and we are doing the C, thumb, index finger on the second string, medium or middle finger on the first string so thumb index medium thumb index medium thumb index medium yes sorry 
No, it sounds, it sounds. Yes? Okay. okay Try also, sorry Serena, I have to show. <laughs> I have to show this exercise. So, for, for arriving here, for arriving here and doing the finger style in the right way, we have to practice the other exercise. So with all our fingers, moving fingers, try to use the thumb because you see the thumb in this exercise is always doing the tum, 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 tum. the thumb is always in the same rhythm. Try also to find a, a, a position for, for you is okay like this. But think about that we, you, have, you have to use, uh, if you want to do the finger picking, you have to do the thumb, you have to use the thumb, the index and the middle one. Okay? See? Yes, exactly. Look at the left, uh, left uh, yes, like this, perfect. Benissimo, eh? You see, everything is a, there is a reason between, be, be, bravissimo. Nice. The, in, the, in the beginning always start slow dun, 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 dun. then when you feel a little bit more confidence brava perfect she, you are you are using also I see that the, the pinky yes pinky is on the on ukulele is another technique but it's important to, that you leave the pinky on the ukulele because then you're stable because if you don't have something when the uh, then you, it's not easy to find the strings in the same position so you have to think too much uh, too many things so okay this is uh, so we learn three exercises for arriving better in this pattern the finger Style, finger picking, finger style, finger picking, finger style. So there is a, um, a basic rule in the finger picking. We always use the thumb for the fourth, the fourth string and the third string. So yes, it's like that. Yes, pollice. I don't know the name in French. Le pouce. Le pouce. pouce. Le pouce. Okay. <laughs> so, okay. Try to build the confidence with the thumb to feeling. And the, the other two strings, the second and the first, the second and the first string is always with the index finger on the second one and the middle finger on the first. You can also do these exercises. Eh? The fingers can be... Allora. Me, I'm not using the uh, pinky to rest on the ukulele. I'm just using my uh, wrist on the ukulele. So, If you want to use the pinky, you can put it here. But for me, yeah, for me, for me, for me, it's not comfortable. If I put the finger here in the guitar, better because it's bigger and have more space. But for me, if I put the finger down, it's not so easy to use these two because they are. I'm feeling that I'm not. Uh, free with my right hand but try always to find your best way to arriving when we want to arrive yes like this is okay are you comfortable yes yeah i'm quite used to it uh -huh. i just kind of shake with my hand uh, yeah I get them out. I know. are you are you yes that's a, that's a good huh? there's one finger for each string sorry can you not use one finger for each string yes uh, you can do that but the best is always to use the thumb on the third and the third string. You, I always say to you the basic. 
but you can find your, your, your best way, how you feel better to play the ukulele. Remember always that you have to be comfortable when you play, not be so angry or something like that. If you feel that you, can, you want to use the ingle, the, I'm, I'm saying this because it's uh, much easier to play the third and the fourth string with the index and the middle, because then you have to use that. If you, you, if you want to play, it's okay for you. Yes, that's it. It's a technique also that, huh? no problem. Yes. So. Yes. I know. I, it's because I'm pressing this finger. Nervous, my brain nervous, is like. Nervous. No, she's doing the same. I want. I want. Um, she. She wants to play the third uh, string with the index finger. It's okay also that I was saying to her that it's okay also that. Yeah. They're, but the they're kind of confused which which one is which. Like I have to get the feeling. In the this room. this is your choice. The basic is to play the fourth and the third string with the thumb. Okay. Yeah. This is. But you can all, if you feel more comfortable to play the third string with the index fingers is okay. So let's make a recap. What we are what we are doing now. We have three exercises. First exercise is to. Play. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Okay, this is one. Then there is the other one. One, 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 two, 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 three, 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 four, 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 four. Okay? Then the, the third one is one, three, two, three, 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 four, three. Okay. You were playing with this part of your finger. I thought you were playing with this part. Don't look at me. <laughs> <laughs> no, the best is to, because uh, uh, it's it is like, no, I'm, I'm like playing from long time. So I can and also put my thumb like here. That is not the correct uh, position. But we should, we should. Yes, because it, the, the best is to always play like a hammer on the string. You see, this is the position because uh, uh, when we are when we start to uh, learn, uh, there is this uh, exercise that you have to you you have to put like a pencil under your finger because if you stay like that. The pencil is not coming. Yeah, ta so it's touching the other string, so it's not the correct position. You have to put your fingers always like this, so we can we have space to the, for the other strings to play. Okay, that's it. So try always to be like a hammer on the strings. Okay. So now we can play. We, I want to show you also another uh, uh, stuff about uh, the, um, uh, the volume that we can use in a song. That's a live metronome, te l'ho scaricato. Vabbè. No, I don't have, I don't have with me. Before I want to show you that. We can uh, download for any kind of uh, store, like Apple Store or Android Store. You have to f download this metronome. Metronome, okay? Metronome. I have. You have. Uh, some. I was using for some. The, the first thing. one that you can see, the the um, icon is a green one. For me, is the best. But it's my, it's my opinion. But every, everything is good. Because this is the next, another next step to build our uh, um, way to play the ukulele. So now, let me wait. I want to show you how it works. I want to show you how it works. Uh, 
this one you have, huh? Perfect. Yes. This, this is metronome beats, but it's all, every every kind of metronome is okay. So now I'm opening. I'm opening the app, no? And it look it look like that. It looks like that. You see, there is a number sixty in this case. If we push play. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You see? One, two, three, four. There are lights. One, two, three, four. Okay? Oh, it's we... like game when I was exactly. Is the ama? Is this? Eh? The 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 the, the, the old metronome was the perfect. Is this? You see, there are plus. And listen, the speed is improving. One, two, three, four. One, two. So now let's start playing with this uh, speed. Is 80 now, okay? We start with this speed, 80. What chord? The, the C chord. Now just playing perfect. Now just playing uh, the C chord in the same only down. Now only down with in the same rhythm. Listen, you are not perfectly in time. That's why it's so difficult to stay in the same time. some other option eh? like this this is the drum boom 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 so you understand what is a metronome this is really important to be always on time the next exercise you can put the metronome at the speed that you prefer in the beginning is always to is better always to play Really slow. We can start also from 60. But listening the difference. Dun, 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 dun. One exercise that you can do by yourself with, with any chords. So you can also practice with the uh, with the um, hard one. But is this? We, we set a, a time, in this game, have 80, no? And before, we try to manage our dynamic on the chord, so... See, now I push up, and then I push low. And this is really, you will see that it's really our um, dynamic on the so before we start and then remember try sometimes or maybe always try to play with the metronome it's like uh, when I count one two three one two three four one two Sorry? How does that work? You can use a different strumming pattern. The same. That's, uh, this is a good question. Let's do 80, no? This is up and down. So 
what you do to this is like a we go slowly no this is too slow sorry practice with uh, um, different kind of strumming pattern with different kind of uh, um, metronome like the speed that's why it is, it is important when I say to you play and count one two three four one two three four one two song of Serena, no? Tap tempo on the there, you see? What we are doing now? One, two, three, four. And now what are we doing? Look, look. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. You have to tap on this uh, uh, button. We want to go faster. One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Faster. One, two, three, four. That's why it's important. Yes, I show you again. So you see, on the right, there is this tap tempo. Ah, this your volume is low because put up. Okay. If you go faster, one, two, three, four. All only yes. Tac, 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 tac. Yes. Okay. Makes me stay with the yes. strings better. I know, it's okay. No. <laughs> Perfect. So some people that uh, doesn't have the time in their mind. Uh, yes. It's very good to use the metronome at the beginning uh, because uh, you never lose your, you never lose the time. Yes. Mm -hmm. So it's very good to study before with it, uh, and then uh, your mind is trained to think in time. Tak, tak. Tuck, tuck. That's why I was. It was boring in the beginning that I said to you, always count one, two, three, four, one, because it's this reason. And there is another reason that yes. is that sometimes we think to be in time, me too, and I'm running and running and running because it's very difficult to stay always in the same time. If we are playing alone, it's okay. We do what we want and it's okay. But if we are playing together, it's impossible to... Ah, uh, yes, yes. This is the reason why you weren't uh, in the lesson, but we were playing together and he told me, follow her, I cannot do that because yeah. we are not in time. Exactly, exactly. So, a lot of uh, eh, dots that are connecting now. Try to use uh, the app, the, me the metronome is the best uh, to improve our time and uh, always you know, also to uh, play better with somebody else. Because we can play ukulele with guitar, we can play ukulele with the drums, we can play ukulele with the bass player, everything. And uh, the, other, the other is the fingers, moving the fingers on the fretboard, okay? And 
playing uh, softly and then push more but with the metronome because this is uh, sometimes when we when we push more we go faster of course because it's a uh, something normal in our brain gears. yes like changing gears so if we push more and we want to go faster but with the metronome the, is, the best is to because we stay always on time running too and that's I mean it's normal it's normal because it's difficult so what we, the last uh, things that we can look today is how it was with the stop uh, strumming you want to try yes. I have another uh, <laughs> Let's do that. I have this. Uh, bravissimo. I have this uh, progression that is nice. Is uh, so is C. So is uh, this progression is C F G F Okay We we want to do everything together we want to push to put everything together So the I know this this is this is the speed. I put a little bit uh, slower. This is 90. That's why I also play with the speed of the metronome. Listen how is it? One, two, three, four, one, two, three. Listening to the key, the key of this 
this exercise is when there is tac, tan, 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 is always when there is a, a count, uh, there is the first down. Tang it, tang it, tang it, down up, down up, stop, down up, stop, down up, stop. Look at because this metronome is good also because there is the light. You see? You see there are the light. So look also your uh, eyes to connect uh, with the time. Down up stop. 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 Oh I know no, it's not easy. Eh? I know. I want to say something because in the beginning is a uh, is funny to play the four chords and play everything when we go deeper it can be a little bit boring or a little bit not so funny but these are the exercise that gives you the uh, how can I say also um, more connection with your instrument because we can we you already know how to play four chords the same you know but if we want to go deeper and uh, improve our ukulele I'm I'm just trying to give you steps that let you go higher and higher in the level then it's always your choice to practice it's always your choice to um, play with the metronome play without play I'm just trying to give you the, the basic, how can I say, it's okay, yes. It's yes. <laughs> <laughs> but in your case, you are yes. thinking too much because yes. you are doing right. Yes, exactly. You have the sensory. Right? Exactly. This is one time to say no. Done you stop. teach me the stop last time. No, this is down up stop four times. See, tang it, tang it, but you can do also one time because uh, Lily, Lily said to me that we were doing the exercise like this. Down up, down up, stop. 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 But what you said, one time uh, down up and we change. Okay. Down. Down up, stop. Down up, stop. Down up, stop. Down up, stop. You see? Just one one time in any down up stop down up stop down up stop down up stop or down up stop 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 or down up stop 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 down up you see or same time, same chords, but same timing of changing the chords. I didn't see it, I didn't get it. You didn't get? No. Look at this. Let's do it again. We can play also, also together. Let's play the same progression. The first time, two, no, sorry, four time in any chord, okay? <coughs> so, down, up, stop. Down, up, so, down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. Then F, down, up, stop. Down up stop, down up stop, down up stop G, down up stop, down up stop, down up stop, down up stop, then F, down up stop, down up stop, down up stop, down up stop. So okay, this is one pattern, okay? Four time in any chords. Now let's do half. Down up stop, down up stop, and change. Two each. Yes, two each. Okay. We we Let's try always with the metronome, man. Eh? No, C F G F. C F G F. One. F. One. G. One. Two. One. Two. F. One. Two. One. Two. One. G. C F. G. Down. Up. Stop. F. Down. Up. Stop. Down up stop C down up stop down up stop F down up stop down up stop G down up stop down up stop F down up stop down up stop You okay, you okay? Yes. Same progression 
but different timing of changing the chords. Last exercise. She's in crisis. <laughs> I know. I mean, it's, she it's, goes like that. It's normal. Oh Last exercise is <laughs> one time. <laughs> blow, blow. One time. And don't think too much because you stay in time. It's okay. Yeah. And uh, last exercise, one time only in any chord, okay? So down, up, stop, change, down, up, stop, change, down, up, stop, change, down, up, stop, change. Wait, let's always li listen. C, F, G, F. C, F, G, C, F, G, F, C, F, G, F, C, F, G, F. And always, wait. Three, four, one, two, one, two. Yes, it's only one, only one. Is it? It's not easy, eh? Wait that we count. One, two, three, four, C. One, two, F, G, F. <laughs> it's difficult. Let's do it really slow. C, F, G, F. Listen now the time. Four, one, down, up, stop. F, stop, G, F. We try to stay. Ah, shit, eh? Yeah, we can say this. Also, you, you, you see, it's so uh, difficult to go slow. Now let's let's uh, let's playing it in our mind. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Down, up, stop. 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 Okay. Down, up, stop. Try to connect. Down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. C, F, G, F. Everybody, bravissimo. Let's, let's start together. Yes, we, we lose ourselves together. So, everybody was in good timing except you that you were running a little bit. So, <laughs> but now I'm just, uh, I don't want, it's not uh, that I, I'm against you, it's just that you realize that you were running. That's, uh, it's normal, eh? That's why, try please to use the metronome. And always, it's easier to go faster than go slower. So, in the beginning, put it down. 65, it seems boring, but, three, four, one, one, stop, one, stop, stop. One, two, enter again. C, 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 stop. F, F, stop. Listen, too fast, too fast. Look. Look at me, eh? Listen now. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. That's it. You see, it's easier to go faster than slower. You see? Yeah. So. Is it is harder to go 65? Try 60. Because then and then increase the speed. Not starting with the uh, faster one and go down. Always start with the slow one and then go up with the speed. Because it's not easy. And you see the, how is uh, the differences between 
we are playing the same chords but just uh, in a different way because in the beginning we were one then so we have three, three different songs okay we can also do last things that then we finish because today we do a lot of stuff we can do also that like So it's one, two, one. You see? So it's two times the C. One, two, one. I, I say, I, I use two times the C, one time the F, two times the G, and one time the F. So this is the mixture of everything. Okay, let's try one, two times uh, and go. Okay, we don't use the metronome because then we put so much. But I count. Let's go so slowly. Down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. C. Down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. F. Down, up, stop. And then G. Down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. F. One down, up, stop. And C. Eh, it's difficult this, eh? Do two times C, one time F, two times G, one time F. One, no, two, one, two, one. Two, one, two, one. Yes, yes. This is the connection that you can give to your brain. F is always one. Yes. Now I understand. Okay. Let's try. <laughs> Ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. Lily, sorry, Lily. So, we now we play two times C, one time F, two times G, one time F. Don't, don't think about the sound is not so perfect because it's not a, a progression that is something but so it's good. Okay. But it's okay. <laughs> we are here for learning. That's why. We are okay. ju I just want to give you um, the, the, um, how you can understand what we are doing. So it's down, up, stop, down, up, stop, then we change, down, up, stop, then we change again, down, up, stop, down, up, stop, and then we change again, and then we change again. We have to remember that the F... The F, F like F she said, the F is one time. Yes. Okay. okay but okay. this, now I'm, I'm saying C, F, G, F, but you can use uh, any chords in this, eh? Just realize that we can mix any time any kind of uh, chords with any kind of rhythm okay that's that's the important the meaning of this uh, lesson of today yes yes okay we try no. wait this is uh, drinking slow eh? one two three four down up stop down up stop F down up stop G down up stop down up stop F down up stop D down stop down up stop F down up stop G G F C Don't 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 give up. She's doing she's doing uh, almost gone. No, she's doing right. That's what I mean. We are together, no? If you lose uh, the timing, if you lose the chords, if you lose, try to go back with the one that is in time. So we can start. Try again. Try again. Last time. So one, two, three, four. Down up. Down up. F. Down up. G, down up, down up, F, C, down up, down up, F, G, ah, the brain is... Uh... <laughs> G. Mm -hmm. 
So let's do a recap. What we what uh, what we done today? We did a lot of like scale. Yes, things. exactly. Like so we have we things. yes scale things. <laughs> so again, okay. This exercise: one finger for one fret in any string. Okay. And go up again. Okay. Then there is the other one for a fret. So first finger. Then second finger. Okay. Up and down. Then the third one is string. Open string. Second. Open. Third. Open. Four, open. You see, because we are using our fingers a lot. A lot and also separated from the other because it is normal also that when we when we move the like this, we can move the pinky. Or if we move the pinky, there is another one. So we are trying to disconnect any fingers from the other. Then what we what we done? The the things of playing smooth. Or push more with the metronome okay set the time and do it smoother louder smoother louder you can also use with the pal with the uh, metronome the palm mood I know, I know, I know. Then, uh, what we done? Playing with the metronome, of course. This is really important. Okay. And then, and then change the chord, then change the rhythm. Yes, then change the chord. I think that the, the best now is to stay with the right uh, strummer down, up, stop. Down, up, stop. Because I think that we have it, more or less, no? So just think that the way how you change the chords between this time. So it can be down, up, stop, down, up, stop, three, four, or one, two, one, two, one, two, one, okay? Or can be one, two, one, two, only one time. Any chords and now I'm we are just playing this but we can also play the tricky one down up stop down up stop down up stop E minor C E minor C E minor C E minor or C D minor or F so we have a lot of options stay with the right hand down up stop down up stop down up stop and changing the course down up stop down up stop down up stop down up stop okay then something else no these are all the things that we have done today write your own song oh yes the most important write your own songs or if you already write your own song just try to put this uh, exercises on your own song so the volume of the right hand the strumming that it can change between the verse and the chorus yeah i show you yes. you can also like we that we are at the beginning we can also do the simple uh, uh, difference between the verse and the chorus that can be the chorus can be g and c no and the same, all the all the um, the lyric, sorry, all the songs is G and C. In the chorus is like this, but in the verse can be. Okay, so we the the beginning of the song is just one strum down. 
Then the chorus. Okay. I'm and what I'm doing with my mouth, with my um, tongue. tongue. What I have to do. The strumming. So down, up, 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 down, You see? So it means that I stay with the rhythm that I want to play in the chorus. But I'm not playing all the rhythm. But in my mind it's still there. So when it will come, I'm ready. Because in the beginning, for me it's normal, I don't have to think, because I can do that and then the, the rhythm is, is coming. Yes. Also if you don't if you don't play and you play only the first like down yes I this is another option you can also tell, uh, like how can I explain uh, you said that you have to put also the lyrics in this pattern separate the, the things okay before you can uh, write your own song in the basic way like you do that you just do she has she has the chords and she has the lyrics what can we do for make the li make the song on another step up let's change the strumming in the first part that can be and then and you see there are a lot of stuff okay grazie thank, thank you so much you. I'm sorry that sometimes it's boring, I understand, no, 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 no. but uh, what can I do, what can I do? I'm it's so glad I came, with no homework done, I was afraid to come, but you've given us so much. Even no, no, that yeah. is better, I know that uh, I was also uh, like a student, no? and sometimes it's not easy to, uh, to practice. It's not boring, it's... Yes, it's not easy to practice, but the best way, of course, of improving your playing is practice. <laughs> and where we can find all the video? Yes. Where we can find all the video? Ah, well, there are all, the lessons are always channel. live. But uh, now I want to, I will uh, record the, the small videos of what we we do today, the, the exercise. So I will send in the group yeah. and then we will uh, we will do because it Because sometimes we can forget. I know, I know. Me, I forgot. I know, I know. And I want to go back in your. Exactly. Exactly. So we I will have do. To go in, on Yes, no, there are also on YouTube. I put yes. the lesson also on YouTube because then, then like you said, you can go in the where you, you prefer. Yeah, exactly, exactly. See, in Instagram yeah. is more. Yeah, 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 yeah. One, uh, one hour is uh, really long. So, that's on YouTube. YouTube. Yes, I, I, will, I will send you. Okay? Thank you. Thank you. Ciao. Ciao, Belle. Will you